Hmm, let's do this. So, GNOME 42 is a good release, but in reality not that great. Reason? The port of files in GTK4 didn't make it on the release. So we stayed with the old implementation in GTK3, that not only it is much slower, but it also looks graphically outdated and out of place. But fortunately everything will be ready for GNOME 43, and files will look gorgeous and will utilize the full power of our GPU. But that's only scratching the surface of what's new. Atta girl! So, apart the actual port to GTK4, we also have two rewrites on the both views. On Icon View we have the new GTK grid, that brings some visual changes and performance improvements, but nothing really dramatically different for your workflow. But the end game is on List View, and the port from GTK Tree to GTK Column View, that delivers long-awaiting features like rubber band selections and much more. Aw oh, man! Add a girl! Oh, by the way? This is still a merge request, so work in progress. But let me show you the main difference of Column View which is a new layout in GTK4. So here we are on GTK4 but with GTK Tree View, and if we open the GTK Inspector, and then try to select the view, we'll notice that it will catch the full widget. Let's repeat on the new column view. Open the inspector again and start selecting. And we see it now can select items individually. Basically in column view every item is a widget. And that allows things that so far weren't but a dream. Aw applesauce! Sec to read you the commit message from the main patch, and what makes it a dream. First we have the rubber band selections I showed you already. Then we have some space between the columns so we can finally get a context menu. Then, everything is more clear, and mostly the various texts and labels. But everything is also more consistent between the two views, like how sorting works. And finally we have a new animation when starring stuff. Huh, to the demo maybe? Hum, the rubber band selections are very accurate without accidentally catches. However the drag and drop hasn't been implemented yet. Right click an item menu, but now between two columns we have a little space we can open the main context menu. However it's not an easy target. Bigger padding will make the view less efficient, so it needs some prediction algorithm. Let's do the star animation next. And then perhaps try the search? Which is a great way to see how the file names are displayed alongside with the location labels. Hmm. And finally let's try on light maybe? Blah! Agreed! Light sucks! Basically I think this view is missing some line separators, so probably on the final release will be a bit better. Oh, and also I use a super large size, so try with some smaller? Meanwhile this notification still looks sweet! So that was everything for now! And the reason I believe Files 43 will revive many people's workflow, is because the list view will be good enough to switch to that for our default layout. We're going in and out, at least for the people who are using the grid exclusively so far. Bye bye